Uh, hi, Emilock came in today. Um, you probably could tell where I'm at. Uh, back in the 90s, there used to be an incinerator here at the American Color and Ke Chemical LLC company. Um, just wait. Okay, um, the incinerator was not just for that American Color chem Chemical Company. It was for the Drake Chemical com Company, too. Um, the, uh, they, uh, they found some bad chemicals, and they, they only figured they couldn't uh, figure out what to do with it, so they decided to build in the big dome incinerator with a stack coming out the top. I mean, it was big and yellow. <laughs> I don't think people nowadays would know that that it was here, so um, I'm over here at the park filming this, but right right in about quarter way out there in this field, it was a huge dome about I would say close to thirty five to forty feet tall, a big yellow dome and Back, I gotta say this. Back when my when uh, Block Cable played played Berwick, my dad said my dad said to uh, oh I guess it was on on uh, Talkback in the morning. He said they that they have they have the nuclear ones and we have the incinerated ones. Uh, I don't know. I was, we got the power from the incinerator, the chemicals from the seminary. They got the chemicals from the. <laughs> From the nuclear power, but I just wanted to throw that in there. <laughs> um, and it's right below the Baltigo Mountains, and I'm, there is uh, one area, Straub Town. I'm not sure where it's located, but it's some. I think it's somewhere in this vicinity, down towards Cast, the Castney area. Um, I think it was started, uh, I think it was built between, uh, 91, and I think it was finished by 98, but I'm not certain on that. So, um, so that's what I came over here for. Um, I'll leave you go on that, that note. Uh, you guys have a good day.